everyone. If you're new, welcome. If you're a subscriber, welcome back. My name is Angie and today I'm going to show you how you can edit an isolated area of an image in Lightroom. So I'm sure a lot of you have had this problem. You're doing your edits, they look great, but one part of the photo looks wrong and whenever you're trying to fix this issue on the main sidebar, it keeps adjusting everything in the photo so this one specific part just never looks right. Well, what I do is I use the brush tool to specifically isolate this area and create edits for it. So I'm going to show you how to do that in this tutorial. I hope you enjoy. This photo was taken in Iceland on top of a glacier. And if we check out the original image, it had a lot warmer tone to it. And that's because this photo was taken at sunset, so all that light was just reflecting off the glacier and the mountain. But what I really wanted was blue tones in the photo to reflect the icy and cold environment. And I was actually able to create this by using the brush tool. I'm going to revert the image back to the unedited version and we'll get started with the edits. So first I'm just going to, off the bat, overlay the photo with my Iceland preset. And already it looks great. The tones are a lot bluer, but it's not as blue as I want it. You can see some of the orange tones peeking through. At first I thought that I could edit this by just altering the temperature, but when I started to do this I noticed that all the blues from the entire photo were just coming through and it looked very unnatural and that's not the look I was going for. So instead I used the brush tool. First thing you're going to do is go down and adjust the brush size and I'm overlaying just one section of the photo coming up to the side menu and lowering the temperature for the brush tool though and as you can see these blues are as unnatural as they were when I adjusted the temperature of the whole image so I'm going to come down to saturation and decrease it to negative 34. Now it blends in better. I'm going to continue overlaying the brush over the glacier and mountain area. When you're doing this, make sure to stay in the lines. So for example, up here at the mountains, I don't want the brush tool to seep into the sky, which is why I'm being very careful along this mountain ridge. And there you go. So if we look at the before and after um, when I had just put my preset over it, as you can see, all of these orange tones have disappeared and made way for a nice icy blue tone. And that's how it's done. If you have any questions or ideas for some other YouTube tutorials, please let me know and leave them in the comments below. For now, feel free to subscribe or check out some of my other tutorials and videos.